My name is Jimmy. What's up, you guys? Arrow is back with season number two. So here's my review of the season two premiere episode, which it's titled City of Heroes. We find out in this episode that it takes place weeks after the destruction of the Glades, and during that time, multiple characters had changed. Oliver, he of course left Starling City because he felt like he failed not only Tommy, but he also failed the city. Uh, Laurel, now she's against the vigilante. And uh, Laurel's father has been demoted. So he's just a regular cop. But I would think he still trusts the vigilante as much as he did in the end. But uh, this uh, premiere episode, I, I would have to say it was really awesome. Because I was getting excited for this season because of all the news we had gotten about certain characters appearing. Some, you know, I'm familiar with. Some I'm really excited for, which there's one character appearance that I'm excited for seeing in this season. I'll give you a hint. He's known to be the fastest man alive. That's like the one, the thing that I'm excited for most in this season. But, uh, yeah, it, it, it's just interesting to see uh, what other characters, you know. I'd like to see, you know, more from the DC Universe rather than Batman villains. I'm not saying that was a, a totally bad thing, but it's, it's like they were trying to make him like Batman. Not trying to talk down on this show. But I would have to say, you know, this uh, premiere episode was really cool. And just like in the past, we did get some flashbacks from the island. I guess we're going to be seeing it in Season 2 also. Of course, since Deathstroke's a ongoing character. And um, it kind of, pretty much quick thing to say about that, there are other people on the island besides fires in his men. But it like takes place like five months after they had taken him down. But at the end of the episode, it looks like Oliver is going to have himself being called Arrow instead of the Hood or the Vigilante. I would think it's probably going to be Arrow because of the show. I'm I think it's pretty unlikely he would call himself Green Arrow. But one thing I would I would think it would be it would make sense seeing in this season because of what has happened. You see Roy Harper take up the mantle of you know, Red Arrow or Speedy, whichever one they go for. That's why I think so, because he wears a red ho hood. Hooded sweatshirt what people call him. I call him a hoodie. But, uh, you know, like I said, I was really, I really liked this premiere episode. And let me know your thoughts and opinions on the premiere episode. And I want to ask you, what are you excited most for in this new season? You already know mine. And I know one friend that would say the same thing as me. And uh, also, later tonight, I'll be doing a review for American Horror Story Coven for BKBN.net Horrorama. So, be on the lookout for that. And as always, for more news and reviews on movies, video games, comic books, and more, you go to BKBN.net and celebrate your nerdom in a big way. I'm Jimmy. Until next time, bye.